Hey guys and welcome back. Lustica has caught herself a small lizard. That's what she's eating. The purring that you hear is Miss Mocha. But yeah, I thought I'd share this uh, lizard feeding. I wasn't certain if they would actually eat it. It was just a little lizard that I had collected when I was getting worms and stuff. Maple's going to walk him away. Everybody thinks that the uh, turtle house is the cool place to hang out. Hey, this isn't about you guys. We're showing the lizard being eaten. I don't know if you guys can hear the popping. Sorry guys, this one's kind of a gross video, but this was kind of neat. Let's see if I can get around on the phone. It's a long reach. I mean, I had heard that turtles would eat small lizards, but I was like, oh, this lizard's out here and it's cold. I'll bring it in and put it in the turtle tank. Thinking that the worst case scenario, like, the lizard just cohabitates with the turtles. The uh, lizard apparently came out of hibernation yesterday when it was really warm, and today, now when it's really cold, he... He probably wouldn't have survived anyways, but he's definitely not going to survive being eaten. <laughs> but yeah, that was fun. So, she's going to go back on the hunt. She done finished her lizard. Trouble's over here. Hunting in the leaves. I ended up adding leaves to this uh, enclosure, and I really, really liked that decision. It was awesome. I'm like, have a little forest in here now. <laughs> I absolutely love it. See how it's all leafy now. And then I found this. It's a living rock. That plant went right through the rock, so I brought that in. You guys should remember that from yesterday. And then we've got the other one over there, because I decided to put the skulls that... Blaze found in the turtle tank. It's looking very wild in here now. I love it. I love that wild feel. Elsa's in that cave. Let's see if we can see her. Not sure if you'll be able to see her or not, but she's in there. background. Hopefully that didn't mess it up too much. You guys were able to see in there. Muskies. Over there eating some more. Trouble hunting. So I brought worms, slugs, and a little lizard in here and I really didn't think that they were going to eat the lizard. I figured it would be okay, but apparently they did eat the lizard. So... There's that. It's kind of neat. <laughs> the cats are both in here. They love it with all the leaves and plants and stuff. And It's like the great outdoors in my house. You guys, it is so amazing. I love it so much. Like, I just get lost here. Just watching everybody play. And all these leaves and stuff. Sorry, that was shaky. There. Now you guys can see what's going on. But yeah, I just wanted to show you guys this uh, short video of them eating and hunting. 
and how natural their environment looks now. I think they're pretty happy. They don't seem to mind the cats. I'm sure you can hear this one purring. This is Mocha. But yeah, they climb right on top of the cats and stuff, so. This is my weird little outdoor adventure area when I'm not outside. I had to bring the great outdoors inside, apparently. But, yeah. See your house back there. Just looking for more food. But I like to bring live things in so that they can still hunt. And be as natural as possible. Even though that there's cats in here. I guess like in the wild they would see cats too though. Kind of makes you wonder if they are friends. Out in the wild even. Cause I've never seen a cat and turtle. Fox turtle anyways. Not get along. So it's kind of interesting. You've got maple over here. See there's a slug. Marlena said that she was sniffing. They like to check out all the bugs and stuff that are in here too. Everybody seems to really enjoy this outdoor type enclosure. I, like I said, I brought the outdoors in. I put weeds and stuff in here. The only thing in here that is like not a weed is this head of lettuce right here. This is a uh, butter lettuce. And, um, yeah, as you can see, it's where the, the turtles will eat pieces of it when they're getting the slugs. So it's really kind of interesting how it works. But it keeps the slugs fed when the turtles aren't eating them, too. And here's Lastica. She's still hunting. She's going to get a worm. Cool is that? It's like a wild adventure. I love this. I'm sure some people find bugs and stuff being eaten is gross, but I just, I love watching them eat. <laughs> I've got maple on the screen again. <laughs> Silly nosy cat. Turtle's over here. Looking amazing. He's so handsome. Poor cat. What are you doing, kitty? Huh? Are you cleaning yourself? She's so relaxed in here. <laughs> but yeah. I just wanted to show you guys what, what's going on. We'll let you go. You guys have a great day. We'll see you next time. Say bye. Bye, guys. Have a great day.